Alright guys, so in this box I have a Samsung Galaxy Note 2, which is the replacement for my S4. Um, I've gone through about four replacements of the S4, and it just keeps having different issues for me. So they finally let me pick a different model of phone entirely, and I decided that I was going to get the Note 2. So that's what's in this box. And there's probably like some sort of paper with my name on it and stuff, and like shipping instructions in here. So I'm just going to cut the video and then get everything out. So I'll see you in a second. Alright guys, so I got the smaller box out of the larger box. Now since this is a replacement, it is not in the Samsung original packaging. But instead it's more of an OEM type packaging. But it does say Samsung Galaxy Note 2. And on the back of the box here, it does have a picture of it. And mine is in titanium gray because it's the only option that they had. And I like the, uh, the gray anyways. So... I don't even know if it comes in white, but I like the look of this phone in gray. So at AT&T, they actually called this silver, which confused me for a second. But then I just asked the guy if it was the same one that was on display, and he said yes. So I'm pretty sure that Samsung calls this titanium gray, but AT&T called it silver. So anyways, I just pulled the phone out, and it was in a bag, so I pulled the bag off. And here we've got the phone wrapped in plastic on both sides. I'm probably going to leave that on there just because I'm going to hopefully go get a screen protector for this thing. Just since it's not Gorilla Glass 3 and it is a little bit more prone to scratching. So I want to keep it nice and protected. So I'm going to leave that on there for now. And then underneath here, I've got an instruction manual. Probably shouldn't need that if you've used an Android phone before got the battery which is pretty huge um, if I remember it's 3100 milliamp hours which is pretty ridiculous for a phone there are some phones coming out that beat it but in relative terms that's still a huge battery so it should last much longer than my s4 ever did because the s4 had some horrible battery problems being that the battery was smaller and it had a 1080p screen I just had horrible battery problems with it so I'm just gonna peel off the back here and I think there might be some special numbers under here that you guys don't need to see so I'm gonna leave that off to the side and pop open my battery put it in it's a massive battery and close it all up and since it is brand new, the cover still snaps on really tightly. Um, the more you take off this back, the cover does start to wear out a little bit. It still holds on firmly, it's just a little bit easier to get off. So I honestly think that my phone, my S4 messing up so many times, was actually a blessing in disguise. <clears throat> because almost immediately after I got the S4, I kind of regretted it just because the screen was large, but not huge. And I honestly wanted a huge screen. So now that I was given the option to get a different phone, um, I did decide to get this one, which has a half inch bigger screen, which doesn't seem like a lot, but it's actually quite a lot. Now this phone only has a 720p screen versus the S4, which has a 1080p screen. However, I looked at it in the store and I don't notice much of a difference. I honestly think the 1080p on the new phones is kind of just to put on the spec sheet because I can't hardly notice a difference. I'm sure there is a small one if I looked really close, but I haven't noticed it, so. I should be plenty fine with this for at least, you know, I think I've got about one more year until my contract runs up because this, I don't think it counts as my upgrade on my contract. So in about a year, I'll probably be able to get a new phone, and this certainly should serve me pretty well until I get a new phone. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching the unboxing of the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 in silver or titanium gray depending on what they call it for you um, if you enjoyed this video please click the like button as that does help me out also leave me a comment about what you liked in the video and what you didn't like and if you'd like to see more of my videos then please click subscribe thank you for watching and i will see you guys later